Welcome to the YouTube channel, Scenic Journeys. Today we are going to explore Missouri. Missouri is a state rich in history, natural beauty, and diverse attractions. Missouri became a state on August 10, 1821. It was the 24th state to join the United States. Stay tuned until the end and learn how to get the best flight deals. 1. St. Louis Gateway Arch Iconic monument symbolizing westward expansion in the United States, offering stunning views from the top. Located at the base of the arch, the museum explores the westward expansion of the United States, including the Lewis and Clark Expedition, the role of St. Louis as the gateway to the west, and the construction of the arch itself. Visitors can take a tram ride to the top of the arch for panoramic views of St. Louis and the Mississippi River. The tram cars are small, pod-like capsules that travel up the curved legs of the arch. At the top of the arch, there is an observation area with windows offering views of up to 30 miles on a clear day. Visitors can see downtown St. Louis, the Mississippi River, and the surrounding area. The Gateway Arch is located near the Mississippi River, and visitors can take a stroll along the riverfront, enjoy a riverboat cruise, or visit nearby attractions like the Old Courthouse and the Museum of Westward Expansion. The arch is also a memorial to Thomas Jefferson, who played a key role in the westward expansion of the United States with the Louisiana Purchase. 2. Kansas City Known for its jazz heritage, delicious barbecue, and vibrant art scene, Nelson Atkins Museum of Art is a renowned art museum that features a diverse collection of more than 35,000 works of art, ranging from ancient to contemporary, including pieces by European masters, American artists, and a vast collection of Asian art. Known simply as the Plaza, this upscale shopping and entertainment district is designed in a Spanish-style architecture and features a wide range of shops, restaurants, and entertainment venues. It's a great place for a leisurely stroll and to soak in the ambiance. Kansas City is famous for its barbecue, so a visit wouldn't be complete without trying some of the city's best offerings. If you're a sports fan, consider catching a Kansas City Royals baseball game at Kauffman Stadium. The stadium is known for its welcoming atmosphere and beautiful fountains, and it's a great way to experience the city's sports culture. 3. Branson Entertainment hub with live shows, theme parks, and outdoor recreational activities in the Ozark Mountains. Branson is often called the live entertainment capital of the world, with more than 100 shows performing daily. Branson Landing is a waterfront shopping, dining, and entertainment district offers a scenic boardwalk along Lake Tanicomo. You can shop at a variety of stores, dine at waterfront restaurants, and even take a cruise on the lake. This 1880s-themed amusement park offers thrilling rides, live shows, and demonstrations of traditional crafts. It's a great place to spend a day with the family. Branson is surrounded by beautiful Ozark Mountains, offering plenty of outdoor activities such as hiking, fishing, and ziplining. Table Rock Lake and Lake Tanicomo are also great for water sports and fishing. Branson is home to one of the world's largest Titanic museums, where you can explore full-scale replicas of the ship's interior, see artifacts from the Titanic, and learn about the passengers and crew. 4. Lake of the Ozarks, a large reservoir with boating, fishing, and waterfront resorts. With over 150 miles of shoreline, the lake is perfect for boating, water skiing, tubing, and jet skiing. You can rent a boat or bring your own and explore the lake's coves and beaches. The Lake of the Ozarks is known for its fishing, with an abundance of bass, crappie, catfish, and other species. There are several hiking and biking trails around the lake, offering scenic views of the water and surrounding forests. The Lake of the Ozarks State Park is a great place to start, with several trails of varying lengths and difficulties. Located on the bluffs overlooking the lake, Haha ha Tonka State Park features hiking trails, picnic areas, and the ruins of a turn-of-the-century castle. 5. Jefferson City the state capital with historic landmarks, museums, and scenic river views. Take a tour of the Missouri State Capitol Building, which features beautiful architecture and houses the Missouri General Assembly. The building's dome is the third largest in the world. Located inside the Capitol Building, the Missouri State Museum offers exhibits on the state's history, including Native American artifacts, Civil War artifacts, and displays on Missouri's role in westward expansion. The Katy Trail State Park is the longest rail trail in the country, stretching for 240 miles across Missouri. Jefferson City is one of the trail's stops, offering scenic views of the Missouri River and the surrounding countryside. If you like what you have seen so far, please click like and subscribe to Scenic Journeys. Subscribing means a channel's videos will appear in your subscription feed, and you'll get notifications and recommended videos from that channel more frequently. Also, subscribing to Scenic Journeys does not cost any money. 6. Springfield Visit the Springfield Art Museum, which features a collection of over 10,000 works of art, including American watercolors, ceramics, and sculpture. Spend a day at the Dickerson Park Zoo, home to over 500 animals from around the world, including giraffes, elephants, and tigers. 7. Columbia Home to the University of Missouri, 
offering a lively art scene, great dining, and outdoor recreation. Explore the University of Missouri campus, which is the state's flagship university and home to several museums, including the Museum of Art and Archaeology and the Museum of Anthropology. Enjoy a leisurely walk, jog, or bike ride along the MKT Nature and Fitness Trail, which runs through Columbia and connects to the Katy Trail State Park, 8 St. Charles. Learn about the Lewis and Clark Expedition at the Lewis and Clark Boathouse and Museum, which features exhibits on the core of Discovery's journey and a replica of the expedition's keelboat. Reenactments of the Lewis and Clark Expedition can be fascinating and educational experiences. They offer a glimpse into the challenges and adventures faced by the Corps of Discovery as they explored the uncharted territory of the American West. Many of these reenactments take place along the Lewis and Clark National Historic Trail, which follows the route of the original expedition. These events often include historical interpreters, demonstrations of period skills and technologies, and presentations on the history and significance of the expedition. If you're interested in attending a Lewis and Clark Expedition reenactment, check with local historical societies, national parks along the trail, or the National Park Service for information on upcoming events. Walk or bike along the Katy Trail State Park, which runs through St. Charles. The trail follows the path of the former Missouri-Kansas-Texas Railroad and offers scenic views of the Missouri River and surrounding countryside. 9. Mark Twain, Boyhood Home and Museum. In Hannibal, where Mark Twain grew up, offering insight into the author's life and work. Tour the house where Samuel Clemens, who would later become known as Mark Twain, spent his formative years. The home has been restored to its 1840s appearance and includes original furnishings. Visit the home of Laura Hawkins, who was the inspiration for the character of Becky Thatcher in Mark Twain's The Adventures of Tom Sawyer. The house is furnished in the style of the mid-19th century. Explore the office where Mark Twain's father, John Marshall Clemens, served as a justice of the peace. The office contains period furnishings and exhibits on the Clemens family. Visit the museum gallery, which features exhibits on Mark Twain's life and work, including original manuscripts, photographs, and personal artifacts. 10. Forest Park St. Louis A large urban park with attractions like the Art Museum, the St. Louis Zoo, and gardens. Explore the St. Louis Zoo, which is home to more than 16,000 animals representing 600 species. The zoo is known for its innovative exhibits, such as the Penguin and Puffin Coast and the River's Edge, which recreates natural habitats. Visit the Missouri History Museum, which offers exhibits on the history of Missouri, St. Louis, and the Mississippi River region. Attend a performance at the Muni, an outdoor theater located in Forest Park. The Muni is America's oldest and largest outdoor theater, and it offers a summer season of musical theater productions. Take a leisurely stroll around the Boathouse and Pagoda Circle, which offers scenic views of Forest Park's lakes and landscapes. You can also rent paddle boats or enjoy a meal at the Boathouse restaurant. I hope you enjoyed today's adventure through the state of Missouri. Don't forget to subscribe, and I hope to see you on the next episode of Scenic Journeys. The bonus for today is a tool to help you save money on flights with the app, Fairdrop. Sign up for Fairdrop to get the best flight deals sent to you as soon as they become available. You can customize your preferred departure airport, destinations, and travel availability. There are two plans to choose from depending on your travel style. Get the link to Fairdrop down below the description.